Hi FMA family, I am over at the Norwalk Reservoir. It is Saturday, uh, day before Easter, and I'm so excited. Um, this is wildflower bloom time, um, the peak. So here you go as the trout lily. Uh, we've got some spring beauties. You've got a bunch of that skunk cabbage, the big leaves in the background. Um, you've got some cut-leaved toothwort. I also uh, saw some trillium. It's getting ready to bloom, maybe on Easter when it's really warm. And uh, gosh, I see the Dutchman breeches. See, it looks like a tooth. So cool. Um, and uh, the bloodwort. So I don't know, I've seen actually a few more species too, but this is just very exciting. If I could tell you one thing about these spring beauties, look at the lines in the flower. That's a regular flower, has uh, five leaves, and uh, those lines, think of an airplane where the, in, in the plane needs um, the runway to land. Those insects right now, these flowers are so important for them, it's gonna guide that insect to the middle of the flower. Uh, so that they can get the pollen they need. Uh, we did see some native insects. These native wildflowers, um, you don't see them in your yard or every place because they really need like rich soils in a forest to grow. Um, and they need lots of sun. So you see all the tree canopies aren't blooming yet with their leaves. This is the perfect time of year, the perfect uh, soil condition. Uh, for these wild blooms in Ohio. So anyways, I hope everybody enjoyed their spring break and I look forward to getting back to lessons um, next week. I just really wanted to share uh, this beautiful day with you and I encourage you to look for wildflowers uh, either at the reservoir, I know Old Woman Creek, a lot of natural areas. This is the, the prime time to be looking. See how many types you can find.